Welcome, I'm Walter Cronkite. The medical world has expanded significantly in recent years. It's no longer a world exclusive to prescription medications and invasive surgical procedures. Even the most traditional doctors today are beginning to recognize the benefits of certain alternative approaches to improve overall health. It's the second most common ailment treated by doctors, low back pain. Orthopedic specialists estimate that 80% of the population will experience some form of lumbar discomfort by the age of 40, making the business of aching backs a booming one. Millions of dollars are spent annually on the treatment of low back pain. And as a matter of fact, over 10% of the total health care dollar goes to the treatment of low back injuries and low back problems. Traditional treatments for the care of the low back would include medication, physical therapy, and ultimately surgery. Surgery is oftentimes fraught with the potential complications, so we obviously would like to have a uh, option or an alternative to operate on people who walk in the door with back pain. The quest for relief has led many patients to such alternatives as chiropractic therapy, massage therapy, acupuncture, or yoga. Back pain is not curable, but it is manageable with appropriate exercise and therapy. Doctors say the most effective way to keep the pain manageable is to target the underlying mechanical problems that are at the root of 97 percent of all low back pain. Mechanical back pain is pain that relates to the stress and strains of the joints and the ligaments and the muscles of the low back. Those segments are always under stress with abnormal bending, stooping, lifting and twisting. Among the most recent developments aimed at addressing the underlying mechanics of acute or chronic low back pain is a technique that actually uses machine mechanics. It's a non-invasive treatment designed to decompress nerve pressure and increase the stability of the lower spine. This procedure works in the reverse way that the condition develops. The loss of the stability of the lumbar spine due to disuse atrophy needs to be restored and the nerve pressure needs to be relieved. This is done through a, a combination of two machines, one that restores strength and stability, the other one decompresses the spine mechanically so that you can target each joint, each vertebral segment independently and provide a, an unloading in a mechanical strength restoration. Skeptics say they don't think a machine can discern the subtle messages of the body like hands-on methods can. But those patients who have explored this type of treatment and experienced results say they're glad there's another option available. I first experienced my back pain after a cardio kickboxing class. And several days after that, I was having lower back pain with uh, shooting pain going down my leg. It's very hard uh, when you're used to being very active and then something happens to your back. I'm feeling great now. I've completed the program and I'm back to uh, doing pretty much, you know, whatever I did before. Living with chronic pain can take its toll, but contemporary therapies designed to help lighten our loads may help cure what ails us and get us back on track. Healthcare remains at the top of most of our concerns today. As new ideas and methods are explored, we'll share them with you. I'm Walter Cronkite. For more information, call American Medical Review at 1-800-880-8485 or log on to WJMKTV.com.